Yeah, so today I want to talk about the Gunslinger class. Uh, it's coming out really soon, and I kind of was curious uh, how you guys are preparing for it, or if you're preparing for it at all. Uh, personally, for me, I'm doing a few things, and I'd be interested to know what you guys are doing. So the first thing I'm doing is, um, if you can see in the bottom left corner, I'm saving a good amount of money, I would say. Um, this is probably some of the most I've saved. I usually always spend it on materials and stuff like that. I've been really saving it, and um, I'll probably give uh, the Gunslinger class about... I would say um, maybe 300 gold and if I really enjoy the class I'll probably give about 500 to it and with that amount of gold I'll probably be able to upgrade it to um, true ivy moon maybe even uh, to legendary like uh, either Seraphs or baleful whichever one's uh, better haven't really looked into that that'll be interesting to know uh, probably baleful but we'll see um, also besides the gold I'm also saving a ton of lunar twilight flowers so with 109, I can get at least a couple pieces, maybe I think like four or five, uh, maybe even sets, I can't really remember. But um, save me a bunch of these, so right when I get to 50 and I do uh, Midnight Sky Petal Plains one time and get the badge, I can immediately get a bunch of Legendary Soul Shields, which I think will really help uh, the progress of my Gunslinger. So those are kind of the two main things I'm doing, just saving a bunch of gold and saving the flowers. Uh, because for one, I don't really need a ton of gold. I'm pretty decently geared. Um, I'm almost 900 AP. I'm definitely not like super geared or anything like that, but I can do most of the content pretty easily. Uh, so I'm not really, you know, stressing about that. Um, so really I'm just saving a decent amount of gold and saving, uh, Twilight Flowers. Uh, another thing that a lot of people I know that are doing that I, I didn't really do, but, um, I have a few friends who, uh, when first the le uh, level 50 vouchers came out, they actually bought them when they're on sale, because if you guys didn't know, they're on sale, I think for like 30% off when they first came out for like a couple weeks. Um, so I know a lot of people who actually bought those, and they've been saving them and saving them until Gunslinger comes out. So immediately when Gunslinger comes out, they're going to use a 50 voucher and be literally like ready to go. So there's a few people that are doing that that are like really, really prepared. Uh, personally, I kind of honestly want to level again. I kind of haven't uh, played the game from level 1 in a long time. So it actually might be a little bit fun to just kind of breeze through the storyline and stuff. So that's actually something I'm looking forward to. I didn't really want to spend... Uh, you know, like 30, 40 butts for a voucher just to get to level 50 when honestly getting to level 50 is pretty damn easy in this game. <laughs> like, especially if you have gems and stuff like that, it's it's really easy. Um, but yeah, those are just the uh, small little things I'm doing for Gunslinger. Uh, I don't think it'll replace my Blade Dancer unless somehow I like super, super enjoy it. But um, it definitely will be an alt character that I'll play on uh, just to have some fun. So um, yeah, that's about it for me. That's what I'm doing. Uh, just curious what you guys are doing. Are you guys saving gold? Are you guys, you know, getting ready for it, or do you guys just not care? You're just, you know, going to ignore it. So let me know what you guys are doing, and I'll be interested to know. So thanks for watching.